times you know Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be filming this makeup look for you guys. It's a back to school simple makeup look. It takes like less than 10 minutes to do for back to school. I hope you guys enjoy this video. Um, stay tuned till the end so you can get my social media stuff. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoy it. So let's get to the video. Okay, so I'm going to start by priming my face with the NYX Angel Veil Primer. Uh, I'm just going to dab a little bit of it all over my face and this will help the makeup last way longer throughout the day. So, or like a foundation. I don't like using foundations for school. I like to go way lighter. So I'm using the Dream BB Cream from Maybelline and I really love this. It actually sort of helps with my oily skin. It's not as oily and the as the Dream Fresh BB Cream. And it's really great. I'm just buffing it in with a brush. For concealer, I'm going to be using the Ancient Age Rewind from Maybelline and I'm just going to blend it in with the Real Techniques blending sponge. Okay, so we can't have this concealer freezing so I'm just going to be using a little bit of baby powder and I'm not going to bake with it, I'm just going to set it like packing on some of that powder underneath my eyes and I'm just going to do that down underneath my eyes so it won't crease and for the rest of my face I'm going to be using the e.l.f. tone correcting powder um, this has four colors in it and it helps to correct your skin so it's like a cream corrector but in powder form and it's way lighter so it doesn't feel that heavy on the skin either so for bronzing slash contouring I'm going to be using my Mahaba Mama bronzer I usually use this for contouring but when I'm gonna use it for bronzing I just use way lighter of it um, way lighter layer on it and I just apply this where I would apply my bronzer and lightly add some of that there um, and also in my forehead area I do some in my chin and a little bit in the sides of my nose so it's kind of like a light contour if you get what I mean now I don't want to use a blush or a highlighter because it blush usually goes away and a highlighter just gets my skin gets oily and doesn't look good so I just use a very luminous blush. I'm using Rosie Oro by Milani Cosmetics. And I really like this. So I just apply it with a fan brush so I could like apply a very light layer of it. So I can have a little bit of highlight going on and a little bit of blush as well, but nothing too crazy if you get what I mean there. I just apply a little bit over my nose too. For my eyes, I keep it really simple. I'm using this ColourPop eyeshadow. It's a really pretty eyeshadow that I really like to use a lot on my daily basis. This eyeshadow is in the shade Plunge and I'm just going to apply it all over my lids. Um, nothing too crazy and a little bit in my inner eye corners to highlight. I'm going to be using the Colossal Mascara. This is the waterproof one from Maybelline. It's really great and it looks very natural, the lashes, and it makes them look very long as well. And I really like how it looks through my glasses when I wear glasses, so yeah. For brows, I'm just going to be using a powder here. 
This is a palette from Estee Lauder. It's the pure color eyeshadow palette. And this is like a chocolate brown. I changed my hair color. My hair color is way lighter now. So I've been doing my brows more of a chocolate brown now instead of a dark brown. Then I just blended them out with a spoolie. For lips, I'm just going to be using a Revlon lipstick. These are the Revlon Color Burst Lip Butters. This is in the shade Strawberry Shortcake. This is the second tube I go through of this. And I love to use it for school. It's one of my fave lipsticks. So yeah, this is the whole entire look, guys. Hope you enjoy it. Um, check out my website. It's hypebypaulaawesome.weebly.com. Um, yeah, so I hope you guys enjoy it. Thanks for watching. Bye, guys. Everybody gets high sometimes, you know What else can we do when we're feeling low? So take a deep breath and let it go You shouldn't be drowning on your own